Do I look bald right now? Don't answer that. Hey, it's me, Mackenzie Marie, and welcome back to my channel. I've been obsessed with Y2K lately. In my last video, y'all were digging the style, loving it. So today I'm gonna do an entire Y2K transformation. I've been feeling a little bit down the dumps. Makeup just makes me happy. I have things to do today, so why not go out looking like a full-on Barbie doll? If you don't know what Y2K is, here, I'm gonna blow your mind a little bit. In 1999, Y2K was a time where people didn't think that the computers were gonna be able to go to 2000, so they called it Y2K. People thought it was gonna be like an apocalypse moment. Well, here we are. Nothing happened. <laughs> I look busted right now. There's no denying it. I need help. I'm taking my shirt off now, so close your eyes. Tell me why this literally took me 10 minutes to figure out how to put on. The shirt looks cute. I know, I got it off of Amazon. If you wanna check it out, I'm gonna have everything linked down below. Let's get started with my hair though. This is a nightmare. <laughs> Somebody cut Jesus. Holy dandruff. For my 90s hairstyle, I was thinking something along the lines of like Xenon. Little twists. I have butterfly clip pom-poms and a bunch of these plastic hair bands. Two pieces in the front have to be out. You know, this is how you do the hairstyle. Right there, that's it. You wanna do those little like puffy, round kind of hair, whatever the hell. I don't even know what you call it. Do I look insane? Look at my hair. So oh my God. How do they do this? Pull the hairs apart. Okay, here we go. This is it. This is what I'm going for. Oh my God. I love it. They tell me nothing. I need pigtails. I need pigtails. Busted out the pom-pom balls. We're going for purple. Oh yeah, yes. You're mad. You're mad. Do these look stupid? <laughs> Maybe I tuck it behind the ear. Flip it with a butterfly clip. Do you see what's going on here? I'm so cute. I'm gonna do makeup now. The vibe I'm going for, real life Bratz doll. When I was obsessed with Bratz because like I was totally a Bratz girl over a Barbie girl. Let me know in the comment section below what kind of girl you are. I thought I was Yasmin. I really don't know what I'm doing. I'm just putting it on. Little cut crease moment, even though I don't know how to do one of those, we're gonna learn today. <laughs> Is a cut crease just like, ooh, I put it in my crease. Is that working? Is that a cut crease? Am I doing it right? I feel like this is how you do it. I don't know what I'm doing. Yo, this is not a makeup tutorial. <laughs> Yo, if you like this video so far, stop what you're doing and hit the thumbs up button now. It lets me know that you like these videos, you enjoy them, and you wanna see more like them. So smash that thumbs up button. I'm trying to get this video to 10,000 thumbs up. I know we can do it, y'all, so hit that thumbs up button. It literally looks like the Walmart brand of a cut crease. So we're just gonna blend it all together. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing half the time. And I think I just got makeup in my eye. I love that for me. Some of these. And these. Yes. I'm going for the big brat's lips. And that's the thesis. These leggings. They gotta go. My WAP necklace, princess necklace. I also made a bunch of clay rings in my last video. Wearing whatever I want these days. Here are my rings. I will also be rocking the neon shades again today. I have these zebra pants, which I feel are so Y2K. They also fit my thick dairy year. Let me go put these on because I don't have any underwear on right now. <laughs> the pants work, but they're not functional. Like, can I squat down? Absolutely not. I'm going to rip them. They are 100% Y2K, so I'm wearing them today. I don't care what anyone says. Ooh, 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 ooh. I'm going to be wearing these shoes. These are literally my favorite shoes, but these are 100% Spice Girls. Let's get one thing straight. I usually wear this bag. This has been my everyday bag lately, but I feel like today these are more so the vibes, so I'm going to be wearing this bag today. Yes, don't mind if I do. If you want to hate on this look, honey, you have problems. Now that I'm ready, let's start the day, honey. Let's go. This is my dwarf avocado tree. She got a little burnt out in the sun, but if I want her to bloom avocados this year, I need to get like a male tree so they like cross pollinate and like mate. I don't know, I guess trees can like do the dirty too. Who knew? My mom grew up on an almond cherry orchard so she knows all about all that stuff and that's what she said I had to do if I want avocados and I want avocados this year. So I'm going to go find an avocado tree today. So that is on a list of things to do by the way. Stay hydrated, BBs. I see y'all been 
been buying this water bottle off of Amazon. Y'all know I've been drinking one of these waters a day and oh my god, I've seen such a difference in my skin, my hair, my body. Like, girl, can you tell? And I've seen that some of you guys have bought this water bottle and if you're interested in getting your own, I have it linked down below. I have my Amazon link to this exact water bottle. So if you wanna get the exact one that I have, click the link in my description and use my Amazon affiliate link. And stay hydrated, baby, because it's hot girl summer all year long. What type of avocado tree does a dwarf avocado tree cross pollinate with? No. Hi, what? Uh, what type of avocado tree does my avocado tree have to cross pollinate with? I know it was a fruit, a fruit of the F U E R T E. There is on the tag. Let's go get this freaking fruit tree because, yes, avocado is a fruit. Look at all the pretty flowers. I'm obsessed with flowers. Oh my god. Where are the avocado trees? Oh my god, if they have no avocado trees. I'm gonna be so upset. Please have an avocado tree for me. Please have an avocado tree for me. Oh wait, is this the avocado tree I need? Wait, this thing is giant. How is this gonna fit in my house? This thing is literally like eight feet tall. They have one, one avocado tree, which is the type that I need. She looks a little um dead though. <laughs> no luck here. All of the avocado trees, are dead. Cross pollination is not happening today. I'm going to try to go to a different Home Depot or like a Lowe's or something to try to find one that's actually, I don't know, alive. Ah! Oh my God, literally falling apart. I'm literally falling apart. Yeah, I could have gotten that avocado tree, but I personally just don't want one that's like burnt, you know? Like I would like a live, well breathing, healthy avocado tree. Making a detour, we're at Trader Ho's. I'm getting my mommy flowers because Mother's Day is tomorrow. Oh my God, wait, there's literally no, they are sold out. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm like literally striking out today. Like what am I doing wrong? I need flowers for my mom. On the hunt for an avocado tree. These are so pretty. Oh my gosh, I love the colors. Oh my god. I want all of them. I need every single one of them. I found an avocado tree, but here's the thing. It's the wrong type. Mine can't pollinate with this type. No. Thank goodness I got something. It might not be an avocado tree, but I got a blackberry bush instead, which was totally not proactive. But yeah, that's what I got. The man working here did let me know that the avocado trees will be in stock in two days. So I was like, might as well get something else instead. I've been wanting blueberries because I'm going to make an entire berry garden in my backyard slash herb garden. And I just love growing plants. I am starving though. I need to eat. I'm not gonna lie. I'm pulling up to a Chick-fil-A right now. I'm gonna try and get like a salad here or something because Hopefully that's healthy. I'm trying to be healthy. Did I mention I'm going to Cancun in like two weeks? Actually one week. What would you say is like the best salad? The best salad? I like the spicy Southwest. Can I get the one that you said and the way that you get it? Okay. Can I just get it like that? I like your um, outfit. Oh, and thank everything. you. <laughs> I'm going over to a new boy's house right now. I'm not gonna say any names or anything, but like, let's just say I'm keeping my options open. I'm not gonna be filming that, but I am gonna be wearing my outfit still. Blackberry bush for the win! I think I did it again. Thank you. Real quick, let me show y'all what I got from Chico Fole. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, it's not my favorite. I'm a farmer boys kind of girl. Just discovered it this year, I'm obsessed. I don't even know what kind of salad this is, but this is what I got with a avocado lime ranch. I'm gonna go eat, I'm gonna go hang for a bit, and I will see you in a sec, baby. I just got back home, and I wanna show you guys what I got to eat for dinner. I had that salad today, but I'm like so hungry still. Stopped at one of my favorite markets called Baleata, and I got a giant, I got a giant thing of ceviche in my door is ringing. This is raw fish that was cooked in limon and lime. Got some chips to eat it with. I do not know what kind of fish this is, if you're wondering. Mm. Should I sludge cake? Because life is all about balance, baby. I try to eat 80% healthy. The other 20% is like, eat whatever I want in moderation. I'm going to go eat this now. 
and I will see you later. Hey queens, I am just now getting into bed and I'm about to go take my makeup off, do my entire skincare routine, and jump into bed and go to sleep. It's one o'clock in the morning, my mommy texted me, and it is officially mommy's day today. So if you have a mother, tell her happy mother's day, or if you have a mother figure, or even if you're just with you and your dad, or whatever it is. I am so super duper sleepy right now and I am ready to go to bed. So, I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. I'm trying to get this video to 10,000 thumbs up, so make sure you smash that thumbs up button if you did enjoy this video. Click the subscribe button, subscribe to my channel, hit the bell button, turn on your post notifications so you can be notified the next time I upload a new YouTube video because I want you to be here first. And if you want to, you can follow me over on Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, or Twitch at Mackenzie Marie because when I'm not over here, I'm definitely over there and you should be too. I love you so freaking much and I will see you here in my next video. Toodles!